Hey guys, it's Robin. 252 days until I turn 30, and I am frustrated with the writing right now. But at least the weight loss is going okay this time. Let me go ahead and get through the check-in. Uh, down 3.6 pounds. Uh, in my continual rubber banding, I was up last check-in, I'm down this check-in, I'm back under 225. Uh, been running like seven kilometers every every run now. Uh, and, and throwing in some other kinds of workout uh, that exercise the upper body as well, um, and that's that's been cool. Uh, as long as I as long as I keep up with that, things uh, things seem to go fairly well. Um, but on the writing front, uh, there's no new news down here about it. Um, I uh, I'm trying to write an article for the Dungeons and Randomness podcast website. Uh, and I try to get one out every Friday. But this latest one, uh, number one, just got late because I got distracted with other things. But number two, now that I've actually like gotten down to business on it and been trying to write it, it just... My... Let me cut to something else here. My, my writing process, when I like write an article or write something factual... Uh, often involves exploring the topic as I write it, so I don't necessarily know what my destination thought is when I start. I explore by writing, and then I kind of double back and, and tie it all together when I get to the end, uh, correcting anything and removing anything that's, that's irrelevant once I kind of get to my point. Uh, it's actually how I did like essays and stuff in college too. I would I would start or papers. I would start them without knowing where I was going. Kind of just posit something relatively general at the beginning and start working through it, and then eventually I would find out what I really thought, and uh, and then I would make the rest of the paper obey whatever my destination was. Um, and that's like that's fine when it all comes together and it works, but it's substantially less fine when you've sat there and done about three or four different tries at it and you keep running into the snags. And it's it's a risk of that process. Like that's the 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 fact of the matter is by doing the process that I use, I'm I'm running that risk by the very nature of what I'm doing. But it usually doesn't hit three or four false starts where suddenly I, I realize I'm having a thought that refutes, uh, you know, all several hundred of the words I've gotten in so far. Um, and several hundred words by themselves don't take long to type, but the thinking that's been going in between them to puzzle out the next paragraph of each, you get the idea. I'm a prisoner of my own process. Um, <laughs> And it would probably help if I just like laid down in bed with a notebook in front of me and kind of tested all the boundaries of what I'm trying to say before I actually like try to make an actual articulated uh, um, comment of any length. Uh, but that's not what I've been doing. I've instead been throwing myself at this Sisyphean task and watching my proverbial boulder roll back down the hill uh, several times now. Uh, so that's infuriating. I'm just putting it down for the night, and I'm going to uh, look at it again tomorrow, or perhaps late tonight, while laying in bed with a notebook, and like I just said. Um, but yeah, so there's that. Then there's the editing on the novel, which is not back yet. This is the day of the deadline, but the time zone that my editor's in is different from my own, and so she's still got like two hours uh, to still be to still be on time like that, and she has said that she is working on finishing up tonight, so uh, I, you know, that's, the deadline is still not passed yet, so she's not late. She is still well within contractual deadline. Uh, and, and yeah, I don't hold anything against that. Um, but at the same time, I had hoped to talk to you about it today, uh, and it's not quite here yet, so I can't talk to you about my reactions to seeing that and, and what that professional editing has has entailed. I don't have the example in front of me to look at and talk to you about yet. Uh, so uh, that will be next time if all functions as planned. Um, and that's it. I'm tired of thinking about writing words right now and being on camera is not much more comforting than that so I'm going to wind things up here. 
Uh, as always, check the links down below in the description for uh, all the social internet things that I do. Uh, they're all linked down there. Um, thanks as always for watching. Take care. I'll see you Thursday.